what keeps me motivated what keeps me inspired what what actually makes me get up the next morning is knowing that at the end of the day I'm going to at least make somebody smile or learn something different my name is Juan Carlos Gill and I've been with Shake Lake Miami for about 15 years I know how it is to live with a disability and honestly sometimes it could be very detrimental and just having somebody else with a disability saying hey you could live on you could uh, you, you could be the next national athlete you could be a uh, lawyer you could work for the justice department you could be you know whoever you are honestly your mind is the only thing that will really stop you I remember when I was in the Miami Marathon two years ago and it downpoured all of a sudden. I'm here shivering because I have cerebral palsy, I'm spasming. I said, oh my God, I can't do this. And uh, the gun went and I went with all the wheelchair athletes without a guide, almost without me seeing anything because there was that much rain, me being legally blind. and. I said, either I stop here or I keep on doing it and, uh, you know, just let faith All take right, its toll, honestly. And, and I came fifth cyclists. overall that race for 26 miles. It was amazing and it really inspired me to do more. And every time I wake up, it, I think about that and honestly, I push myself harder and harder. Being with a disability doesn't mean that it's pretty much the end of the world for them. You could do so much. I know how difficult it is because I've, ha I've had this, these challenges in the past for me. So for a very long time I said, well, let me try to help others. Juan Carlos is, you know, a great leader and he really, you know, told me a lot about the organization and, you know, I'm really excited. It's my first time here at Shake Lake and I am so excited and anxious, you know, to get in the water and you know, to see what I'm capable of doing. Shake Leg uh, has been a great frontier in my life and has opened a lot of doors. I enjoyed sailing, I really did. It opened my eyes to a different uh, light, honestly. Ready? I'm not just a person in a wheelchair. I'm an individual that wants okay. to strive for excellence. I just see people smiling. I see, uh, I see their, uh, their amazing smile when they see that people like myself could give five minutes of their time to, uh, you know, to help them. And that to me is gratification in itself.